Hi, Yukonil family. My name's Sheena. Thanks for listening. We're reading October 8th in our Jesus Calling. If this is your first time, I'm glad you're joining us today. It says, I love you with everlasting love. The human mind cannot comprehend my constancy. Your emotions flicker and falter in the face of varying circumstances, and you tend to protect your fickle feelings onto me. Not protect, I'm sorry, project your fickle feelings onto me. Thus, you do not benefit fully from my unfailing love. You need to look beyond the flux of circumstances and discover me gazing lovingly back at you. This awareness of my presence strengthens you as you receive and respond to my love. I am the same yesterday, today, and forever. Let my love flow into you continually. You need your need for me is as constant as the outflow of my love to you. All right, that con- concludes the devotion. I'm going to go ahead and read the scripture. Sorry, I got a little tongue-tied uh, reading that today. So the first scripture is Jeremiah chapter 31, verse 3. Long ago, the Lord said to Israel, I have loved you, my people, with an everlasting love. And you know, that same everlasting love is the way that Jesus loves you today. Amen. And the next scripture is in Exodus. So let me turn there to chapter 15. And we're going to be looking at verse 13. Exodus 15 verse 13 reads, With unfailing love you will lead this people whom you have ransomed. You will guide them in your strength to the place where your holiness dwells. And um, obviously they're talking about the Israelites who were led out of Egypt. And you don't we all want to be <laughs> led to that place where God's holiness dwells just to be in his presence because he is a holy God. Amen. And the last scripture for today is Hebrews 13, verse 8, that says Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. And, you know, that's a good verse to memorize when things aren't going well. You know, instead of getting all flustered, like the devotion was talking about, just know that God doesn't change, that um, he sent his son here, and Jesus Christ is the same yesterday and forever. He can be counted and depended on. Amen. So that's the end of the devotional. Thanks for listening. I hope you got something out of it and and some verses you might want to tuck away in your heart. Always remember, true healing begins with self-love. Why? Because God is love and he lives on the inside of you. We'll be back tomorrow. Thanks for listening. Bye.